Hello, my name is Jesus Medina. I'm the creator of KO Method, which is a holistic approach to fitness and self-defense training. I'm also the owner of Seabreeze Fitness in Costa Mesa, California, which is where we are right now recording this. Uh, today I want to go ahead and cover uh, ab routine. I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a calisthenic type of uh, ab routine, which means there's not going to be no equipment or anything like that. It's nothing but body weight resistant. This is for uh, you know from the, the uh, from for beginners. Uh, this is the, this is also a phenomenal workout for actually for anybody, athletes, whatever the case may be. Uh, but I'm saying that um, uh, for a beginner, they would want to start something like this, opposed to uh, using you know machines with you know actual load aside from their body uh, weight. You know because your uh, your body will take too much shock and it just it would just be a little too too difficult of a progress to uh, advance with. Uh, anyhow, today I want to go ahead and cover abs, like I said, for the most part. Uh, and one thing is, I told you guys, uh, uh, I'm giving myself a 10 week challenge that in 10 weeks or 70 days, I'm going to get my 10 pack back. All right, um, it's still there, I mean, you can't, you can't really uh, see it without flexing that much. Uh, but I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to go ahead and develop that to show it to you guys. One thing I would like to point out is that um, if you guys plan on getting a, a 10 pack or even an 8 pack, but if you guys plan on getting a 10 pack, you need to get a, a, a decline sit up bench. Without it, you'll never grow the, the bottom part of your abs uh, enough to show definition, to show the cutness of those muscles. All right, and I want to show you, I got two different types right here. There's more, but I got two right here, okay? They're both decline benches. All right, this one, as you can see, it's a little smaller, right? Uh, and as you can see, you can fit in it just right. All right, and that's all you need. All right, you don't need all this extra space like this one has. All right, that's all you need right here. That's it. Uh, I want to show you guys that this one has the option of going flat. All right, so you can make it flat, but this one doesn't have the option of going incline, meaning go, this going up. All right, so uh, uh, and once again, these you don't—they're not just only for abs. You can use them for uh, for chest muscles, all kinds of muscles. You're only limited to your creativity, so you can use all kinds of. Uh, uh, Work out all kinds of muscles with that little bench right there. All right, so this is the second one. All right, it's a decline. All right, this stays like that the whole time. All right, but you can adjust it. There's one setting flat overall. There's another setting. All right, so there's so forth. There's another one, and so on. And there's another one. All right, so. That's the other kind. This one's obviously a little more expensive than this one. It's a lot bigger, uh, has more options, stuff like that, opposed to that one. Anyhow, anything you see behind me, anything, any any object here, you can use that all to work out your abs, to work out your core, to work out your obliques, uh, uh, lower abs, and stuff like that. But once again, without this machine, the, the decline bench will never get the 10 pack enough to show it. 